Hello, everybody. So my name is Andrea Majewski, and I own my own dental hygiene mobile practice. So if you are new to dentistry in a mobile way, you are probably confused and have questions on how that works exactly. And that's a very common question that I do have is, well, how does mobile dental work? How does that work? You know, how do you bring everything into the home? So a lot of people might think that I have a van that I bring in and then you come into my van <laughs> and clean teeth, but that's not how I do it. So what I do is I bring everything into your home. So I have a patient chair, I have my own instruments, I have a table that I set up, plus I have something called a compressor unit. So when you have gone to the dental office before, you're thinking about the air, the water, the suction. So I have all of that portable that I bring into your home and it doesn't take up a lot of room at all. I have been in the dental profession now for about 15 years. I am a registered um, restorative dental hygienist. So that's not very common in Ontario. So what that means is I have additional skills that I can perform a certain um, restorative work as well. So if you have a cavity, I can place certain fillings on certain teeth, depending on how deep the cavity is. I might still suggest you see a dentist for a checkup if I feel it's needed, but there are many different things that I can do on top of a dental hy um, hygienist because I have that additional skill set. So if you guys have any questions about that, let me know. Absolutely. But um, so you might wonder, well, who is mobile dental hygiene for? I first thought that I would be seeing patients in a nursing home where I would be going to nursing homes and seeing patients that way because they can't leave the nursing home in most cases. But now with the pandemic, a lot of people don't want to leave their homes necessarily if they don't have to. But even when I first started my mobile hygiene business about two years ago, I started to realize there are so much, there are many different avenues where people need mobile dental hygiene care. I see a lot of patients where they are very nervous. They are very anxious. They don't want to go to a dental office because as soon as they walk in, they can smell the dental office smells. They can see the dental office, you know, sights. They can hear the handpiece. They can hear the sterilizer working away and they see other nervous patients. So that doesn't really make for a very good experience for you, right? Or you might be worried that it's been 10 years, let's say since you had your teeth cleaned last, and you might be thinking your teeth look so horrible that you don't want to show anybody and you're nervous that we are going to yell at you for not taking care of your teeth. Those are very valid concerns. But the nice thing is when I come into your own home, you don't smell those dental office smells. You don't see all of those different dental office things and you're in your own home. You would be amazed how much more comfortable you feel in your own home. Plus, I'm not here to yell at you. If you haven't had your teeth cleaned in 10 years, that's okay. I don't mind. It's almost exciting for me. You know, when I see teeth that need to be cleaned, I like that. That's what I do every day. And you have to start somewhere. So my patients always tell me that they know I'm not going to yell at them and they can appreciate that. I'm not your mother. I'm not your father. I'm not going to yell at you, but I am here to make your oral health as healthy as possible. So I'm going to tell you things you might change to make things better. It could mean you should have your teeth cleaned every four months instead of every six months. There are many different things. So I do offer a lot to you. But also I see a lot of people where they like to see everybody and have everybody's teeth cleaned at the same time. So mom, dad, you know, three kids. If you go to a dental office, that's a full six hour appointment basically, because they would likely see one person after another. Well, I can come in and see everybody on the same day. You don't have to leave your home. So the full family can have their teeth cleaned in one day. You don't have to leave. You don't have to waste time energy, time is a big one, right? So everybody loves that too. But there's also children. A lot of children are nervous to go to the dental office because it's like going to a doctor's office. They don't know what to expect. They don't know what's going to happen. But when I come into your own home, your children see me more as a friend of 
mom and dads who likes to count teeth, I bring a toy box. They can watch TV. They can do whatever they want and I do everything there for them. A common question that people ask me is, how early should their child be seen for a dental hygiene checkup? I say as early as age two, even 18 months in some cases, because it's just good for me to look inside their mouth, make sure nothing is going on. You can get a cavity at any age when they have teeth. So it's nice for me to check up on things and maybe offer you a different toothpaste or something to really help them not get cavities because you want to prevent things in children but in yourself as well. Sometimes people are not using the right toothpaste, mouthwash, but it can make all the difference. If your teeth are cold sensitive, you're probably not using the right toothpaste. It can be as simple as just me looking in there, seeing what you have, and then offering you different oral hygiene aids, which I do have everything with me. So I am mobile in every sense of the word. I have different toothpaste with me, mouthwash, everything. So you never have to order any oral hygiene aid Again, I have everything for you and I can tell you what works for you. So let's see, did I forget anything you guys? So let me know please if you have any questions. I see children, I see adults, I see seniors, especially in our pandemic. I know people would prefer to stay at home, so let me come to you. If you guys have seen the pictures, I do have the full PPE on when I am cleaning your teeth. So mask, glove, gown, face shield. So I do have everything to make it as safe as possible for me and as safe as possible for you too. But please let me know if you have any questions. This was a longer video. So if you did stay until the end, good for you. But let me know if you have any questions. I am so happy to help and I hope to see you all very, very soon.